na mapendekezo kuhusu mfumo mpya wa ugavi wa mapato yaliyowasilishwa na seneta wa Nairobi Johnson Sakaja na mwenzake wa Meru Mithika Linturi yataunganishwa huku juhudi za kutafuta suluhu kwa mzozo kuhusu mfumo huo zikishika kasi kundi moja la maseneta wanaojiita kuwa maseneta walio na maoni sawa likiongozwa na Kipchumba Murkomen wa Elgeyo Marakwet liliongoza harakati hizo na sasa linasema kuwa hatua hiyo itasuluhisha mzozo uliopo ambao unatishia kutatiza ugavi wa fedha kwa kaunti Jumanne wiki hii bunge la seneti liliahirisha mjadala kuhusu mfumo mpya wa ugavi wa mapato kwa mara saba. Seneta wa Elgeyo mara kwa Kipchumba Murkomen aliwasilisha hoja ya kuahirisha mjadala huo bungeni ili kuwezesha maseneta kuafikia makubaliano. Marekebisho yaliyowasilishwa na seneta wa Nairobi Johnson Sakaj na mwenzake wa Meru Mithika Linturi bado hayajajadiliwa. Na leo baadhi ya maseneta wa kiongozi na Kipchumba Murkomen wametangaza kwamba mapendekezo hayo mawili yataunganishwa ambapo waliwahimiza wawili hao wasilishe rasimu ya mwisho Jumatatu ijayo. Towards finding a final solution, we have mandated Senator Sakaja to work with Senator Linturi in consultation with other colleagues to ensure that they ban the midnight oil and give us the final document or on before 10th August 2020. Both senators will agree on how to co-sponsor co -sponsor the approved version. We believe that the proposed solution brings to an end the prolonged debate on this matter and that on Tuesday 11th August 2020 the Senate will pass the final the final version unanimously. Maseneta hao walidai kwamba mapendekezo ya Mithika Linturi ni toleo lililoboreshwa la mapendekezo ya Sakaja. Na hivyo kuunganisha mapendekezo hayo mawili kutakuwa suluhu mwafaka kwa mzozo uliopo kuhusu mfumo wa ugavi wa mapato. We are saying Senator Sakaja and Senator Linturi represent our views. But we are not saying we have the capacity to close other views of other senators. But as a team Senator Sakaja and Linturi represent those views and they are they are already in talks with the speaker. Yeah, they are they are speaking with the speaker. They will agree how they will meet with the speaker and the speaker will we'll see how to process all these amendments that's not a small number we used to ambia what they had what went up and na corona na wajaliba rent nyinyi mna tupatia stress boy ah wafanye kazi wa kigoma wao nataka niende niwaambie nini na watu ya national government wamelipa mshahara kwani pesa ya national government na kulipa mshahara ilitoka wapi ya kulipa accounts ilikuwa mawapi we cannot be struggling na wengine wanakaa huko hawataka kurelease pesa ya mshahara Haya najiri huku seneta wa kilicho Aaron Chiriot akitoa wito kwa Wizara ya Afya kuipa ruzuku kwa masharti hospitali ya matibabu maalum ya kaunti ya Kiricho ili kulipa deni ambalo limefikia shilingi bilioni moja. If you see uh, the division of revenue bills that we do at the Senate there is a provision for funds that go to level 5 hospitals. This is a level 5 hospital. Therefore there is absolutely no reason why it's not receiving those particular funds and therefore Actually we shall be demanding for 2019, 2020 and the subsequent years.